Hi guys, how you doing? I'm commercial photographer Matthew Jordan Smith. And I spent the last 29 years doing pictures of celebrities, models, and people often ask, oh, do you get nervous taking pictures of celebrities or the models? And to be honest, I don't. I'm trying to make a very intimate situation so everybody feels comfortable in the room. When you're the photographer, you are also the director, which means everything that happens in front of your camera is because of you. So you have to make your subject feel comfortable. So how do you do that? Simple, human interaction. Forget about the camera and the lights. It's about you making a connection with your subject. Make them feel comfortable. Well, how do you do that? Stop thinking and just do it. You see a beautiful subject, you tell her she's beautiful. You see a handsome subject, you tell him he's handsome. Give compliments on the dress or the hair or her eyes, or in this case, everything. Make them feel like they are the most handsome or the most beautiful person on the planet. When people feel good, it shows in the picture. That's how you make everybody feel comfortable, whether it's the most famous celebrity in the world, or it's your, your sibling or your parents. Make them feel comfortable and you have a great shot. But this is what it feels like to do this. Ah, Kate, it's now time for you and I to go to work. I love that smile. Beautiful. Oh, wow. Your husband is a lucky man. That's nice right there. Beautiful. Ah, oh, bring that smile 10% for me. That's it, that's it. Now very soft. Lovely. Do me a favor and bring this beautiful shoulder around just a little bit. Just like that. I can get lost in your eyes. Oh my God, this is great. Right there. Beautiful. Now guys, notice, as I'm shooting to her, I'm also kind of whispering. Let's think about that. How do you feel when somebody's shouting at you? And how do you feel when they whisper at you? It's a very different feeling and it changes everything. You wanna make them feel comfortable being in that seat and if you don't know what that feels like, you should first sit where your subject is, find out how they feel being in front of the camera, in front of the lights, and keep that in mind as you shoot. If it's hot, if it's, if it's cold, make it comfortable for them. And then get to work taking pictures. Wow. I love my job. This is great. Right there. Right there. Beautiful. That's it. Just like that. Just like that. Just like that. Love that. Beautiful. Nice. Bring that shoulder around just a little bit more for me. Oh, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Love that. Beautiful. Nice. Soft and relaxed. There. Tilt your head just a tad for me right there. That's what I want. Same thing, same thing, right there. Lovely, lovely. This is your new car, dear. Love that, let that smile go there, there, there. <laughs> Guys, I'm out of time, but I can continue doing this all day and all night. Make them feel comfortable, feel beautiful, feel handsome. Once you do that, you have an amazing shot, and now you just take this picture into perfectly clear and make it absolutely flawless. So now we're gonna go back in studio and make this picture perfect. Let's go into photo, edit in, perfectly clear, complete. Edit. Wow, let's go to our presets. So our details right away makes a fast adjustment and this does a really cool job right away. Let's look at our uh, other options. Let's look at Vivid, which takes and just gives you a lot more clarity and, and punch to the color. Look at the green dress. Even her eyes pop out more. Then Beautify, which is really nice. I like that a lot. 
if you want to go a tad more, Beautify Plus. She has beautiful skin, but let's see some of the skin presets. Oh, wow. So let's look at clear skin. That's nice. Let's see the healthy glow. Oh, wow. Look at her, her teeth and her eyes. It's just, she's a healthy glow now. Let's see a stronger version of that. Strong glow. Gives her more blush there. That's beautiful. Let's go to healthy glow and make our adjustments right here. I like this with the skin right away, but let's go to the eyes. Let's make it an eye enhancement. I'm going to take this up quite a bit here. Oh, now those beautiful eyes really pop out. Let's go and just enlarge them just a bit there. That's nice. Let's look at this before, after, before, after. Now let's go add some more under the eyes by adding a bit more. Oh, that's nice. That's beautiful. Before, after, before, after. Now she has a few blemishes here, so I'm going to turn my blemish removal up a bit here. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Okay. Now before, after. Before and after. This is looking really beautiful now. I think I turn on this just a little bit. Let's look at the skin and depth bias just a little bit here. This controls the balance between the skin and the background. Oh, that looks nice. Okay, I think we're done, guys. Beautiful. Before, after. And we'll save this. Hit my return key. Okay, now we're back in Lightroom. Let's go full screen, hit my F key. Wow. The before and the after. Wow, she looks amazing. Now, she looks amazing from the very beginning, but now she's really popping here. This is beautiful.